Good evening. I am Ninja Dan. And I have been studying ninjutsu for the past eight years. This is like all the martial arts rolled up into one. And another thing that's quite unique about ninjutsu is the nine mind gates that it portrays. <clears throat> And what that does is it strengthens your mind and your body, but not even just that. You go beyond the physical plane, which is a spiritual plane, which is out-of-body out body experiences. Uh, it could mean, uh, you know, you get psychic impressions in your mind. You can foresee things. Uh, you, you become very mentally... Acu uh, mental acuity becomes very strong and very, very accurate. So, uh, what we're talking about tonight is we're continuing on with the series of the nine mind gates of the Kujikiri. And uh, so what we're talking about tonight is we are talking about the next one, which is num the mind gate number five. Or no, mind gate number six. No, mind gate number five, sorry. Uh, mind gate number five is um, Jen. Okay, it's called Jen. And Jen means knowing the thoughts of others. And this, this is uh, in harmony with what I talked about earlier. About actually not so much reading people's minds, but knowing their intentions before they reveal it to you you already are one step ahead of them. So that's that's actually getting one up on your enemy or somebody that wants to do you harm or somebody that's up to no good. You already know what's going to happen before it happens. And this is by using Jen. Jen is uh, quite incredible because um, once you get into the meditative state and you move beyond the physical... Uh, you will actually uh, start like hearing voices in your mind, uh, people's voices, uh, maybe you know different situations, and pay attention to it because what's happening is your super consciousness is warning you. Okay, so that's one thing to really remember. Okay, uh, it's a warning uh, alarm system uh, that your your mind is um, letting you know that something is amiss, something's not right. So, how we do Jen is, remember number four, which was Sha, like a prayer gesture, and you put your thumbs together, and you clasp your hands together like this, right? Okay, uh, Jen is just the opposite. Jen, you move your fingers inwards towards your palms, and then lock them like that, okay? Put your thumbs together, and close your eyes, inhale through your nose, and exhale through your mouth. Like so, okay? So, uh, it will take some time to actually start knowing the thoughts of others. Because this is actually uh, mind gate number five. So it's progressive. And um, the next one is um, even more quite uh, insightful. And just stay tuned for next week on that one. Okay. Thank you very much for uh, watching. And uh, do stay tuned for next week. And do remember to um, subscribe to my channel. This is Ninja Den. Alter Ego for Reg D. Lions. Signing off for now. Good night.